Hello, I thought I would record a quick video on uh, how to resolve uh, threads in a merge request so that you can merge the MR. So here I have an MR and uh, the pipeline has passed and there are no merge conflicts, but uh, it says here there are unresolved threads and the merge button is grayed out. So in order to merge this MR, I need to resolve the threads. And this is a feature that is set up so that if there is discussion on a merge request, it's to ensure that all of the issues that were raised by other people who reviewed the merge request actually got addressed before uh, things got merged. But this can kind of be confusing at times if you don't do a lot of MR review uh, frequently. So here is a box that will tell you how many threads there are, uh, how many discussion threads, and how many of them are resolved. So in this case, I have two out of three threads resolved. And I can either click a button like here or here that will create an issue. It'll resolve all of these threads and create an issue to resolve them later. Sometimes I might want to merge this and uh, address the issues that were left unaddressed for this merge request in a, in a new issue. And that's when I would use those buttons. Or in this case today, I'm just gonna resolve them. So here I can use to jump to the first unresolved thread. And here I can see that there is some discussion and uh, I'm being asked to help out. In this case, what I need to do is resolve the thread. So once I resolve the thread, you can see up at the top of the merge request, now I'm able to merge because there are no unresolved threads. It says three out of three threads resolved. And uh, so in this case, I'll delete the source branch and squash commits and merge the MR. So hopefully that was a helpful quick tutorial on resolving comments and uh, what you can do before you can merge a merge request.